When the news started coming out this morning that a ship with an American crew was taken over by pirates, a Seattle man took notice. Well, he knows firsthand what it's like to lose a ship to pirates. And as King 5's Gary Chittam shows us now, he has the video to back it up. The Falu Atoll, the northernmost island of the Maldive Islands. A crew member aboard the research vessel Elise Maru describes the peaceful scene off the Maldives Islands back in 1978. That was about to change. Our decks are covered with them and there's over 15 of their war canoes tied to the stern of our boat. The engine room is under a complete siege and closed up. First of all, the first mate got roped up and conked with a spear and a club and put in the canoe. John Dickinson was a part owner of the Elise Maru and was on his way to meet it in Yemen when he learned it was taken over by Maldivian pirates. Trying to repair the cylinder head. Dickinson says his crew needed repairs and was lured into the islands by seemingly friendly islanders. He says his partner Gary locked himself in the radio room and shot this film. As you can see, more and more of them are coming aboard every moment. All the war canoes at the stern, they're all tied to our boat. And more and more, all around the horizon, as far as we can uh, see. More and more and more. Uh, of the Maldivians started getting on board and they were taking things as fast as they could off of the ship. Including, says Dickinson, a crew member. And when two other crew members went ashore to find him, they too were taken hostage. He says it ended only after the ship fled without those crew members and U.S. negotiators weeks later got the hostages released. As terrifying as it all was, Dickinson says he hopes the current situation off Somalia will end the same way. Gary Chittam, King 5 News. Dickinson said since that event occurred, he has studied piracy, and he thinks it's a problem that has never really been solved and probably never will be. If you'd like to watch that entire film, we've put a link to our website, king5.com.